This is how Elemental Coffee brews with a Hario V60 pour over cone. I'm Paul with Elemental Coffee, and today we're talking about how to make coffee in a Hario V60 cone. What you'll need is a spoon, a scale, and a timer, or both of them in one, a Hario V60 brewing cone, a filter that fits, and 26 grams of coffee. Uh, we're gonna start by folding the seam of the V60 filter and opening that up and placing it right inside our V60. At that point, we wanna rinse the filter with hot water so that our coffee doesn't taste papery and also we have consistent heat during the brewing process. So we're gonna rinse out the filter with hot water from our kettle. And at this point, after we've zeroed out our scale and our timer, we're actually ready to add our coffee. We wanna grind our coffee um, pretty fine, like on the finer side of medium, uh, 16 to 18 if you're on a Barazza style grinder, um, probably medium for most home grinders. Um, and we want there to be the shortest amount of time possible in between when we grind and when we brew our coffee. Um, so it's gonna be 26 grams of coffee. We've got ground. We're gonna add it, and we might just kind of set the coffee inside the V60. At this point, we'll tear our scale again back to zero, and we're ready to add some hot water from our kettle. Um, we're gonna add 40 grams, and then let that 40 grams sit or bloom in the coffee for 40 seconds. So we're gonna start our timer. And we're gonna add water in really small, concentric circles very carefully. You want to avoid pouring on the outside rim or the filter area because then our coffee can end up tasting actually like really papery. After 40 seconds, we're gonna continue adding water to our V60 and the total volume at the end is gonna be 340 grams. So I'm gonna add all of that now very slowly through the same process of very slight gradual and slow concentric circles. I wanna produce the most consistent motion that I can all the way up to 340 grams of water. And this ratio of 26 grams of coffee to 340 grams of water is gonna yield us about uh, 10 ounces, liquid ounces of coffee as a final product. So it's about a mug's worth of coffee. At 340 grams, I'm gonna stop pouring, and I'm gonna take a spoon, and I'm really gently just gonna stir the grounds a little bit. This entire brewing process will take two minutes and 30 seconds. So th after this drawdown is finished, what we should be left with is a, a flat base of ground coffee at the bottom of our brewing filter. After two minutes and 30 seconds, after the drawdown has completed, we can actually just remove our filter. Remove our cone. And we're ready to serve our coffee. And that's how you make coffee with a Hario V60 brewing cone.